Right guys, so welcome back to some more Fours Motorsports. It's JDSR 15 here. And yeah, I left off here when I found out there's 15 races in each of these. I actually found out the game is, I think it's 70 to 90 hours worth of gameplay. I think I've recorded about half an hour so far. Yeah. But yeah, without further ado, let's jump in with the Challenger Series. You are now entered in the Challenger Series. Each circuit in this series will challenge different aspects of your car and your skill as a driver. Let's go choose what kind of car you'll be driving. Let's. Each division contains a group of cars from a specific car subculture. Select one of the highlighted divisions below to choose a car from its roster. Obviously, we're going to start with the sports coupe. Two doors on a small car. Lightweight, pokey, skinny tired, rear wheel drive and affordable. Sounds simple, doesn't it? Yet it takes guts for a manufacturer to produce cars like these. Cars that take the demands of practical motoring and place them on the non-existent back seat. Because really, they're made for one thing. Driving. Even if you have nowhere to go. Okay, so didn't realise Top Gear. Because no, Top Gear is kind of not a thing now, so... Surprised to hear Richard Ammon's voice there. So we've got an Eagle, Honda, Nissan, or Nissan, Toyota, Alfa Romeo, another Alfa, another Alfa, Honda, Lexus, the Mazda, another Mazda, another Mazda, another Mazda, another Mazda, another Mazda! Nissan, 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 Nissan. I'm just going to say Nissan, Nissan, Renault. Skion, Subaru, Subaru, Toyota, 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 Toyota. There's quite a few cars in this I would like to choose. One of them this. 45 grand, that is a lot. But this. Although this is this is actually more expensive. Yeah. The Mazda MX5, the brand new 2016. We're going with this car. We're going with this car. This is your 2016 Mazda MX-5. You're all set up to race in the Super Street Challenger Series. Let's go. The first race of this series takes place at Watkins Glen, a course that favors powerful vehicles that can make short work of its steep elevation changes. Okay, so Watkins Glen. Never heard of this track, ever. I've seen pictures of the track, never knew it was called that. So, elevation, so I mean that goes uphill and downhill and like this. So yeah, let's begin. There's the little Mazda. Oh, it's so cool! Forza Motorsport 6 is a realistic simulation that features several assists to make driving approachable for everyone. In the assists menu, you can adjust these settings to experience the full depth of this simulation. I think I'm okay. We're going to have a look at some mods. We're going to buy a mod pack. Just going to buy the simple, the basic one. Although, what? 300,000. No, I'm okay. Just buy the 12,000. What we're going to get in the basic mod pack? A boost. Okay, okay. Another boost. Another boost. Another boost. Another boost. Let's go. Okay, so we've got another Mazda next to us. Surrounded by Mazdas. Mazda, Mazda, I'm the Mazda. Don't seem to have that much power, even though I put power in. I put straight line speed power in my car. Oh, uh, that grip doesn't seem to hurt much, but it's fine. Wow, we made him go flying. I mean, you're aggressive, driver tar. Be aggressive. Smash into me like I'd smash into you. So these are the elevations, so my speed should help out here. We're going up and down hills to do a little bit break. Oh, it's so cool. We had this in Forza Horizon 2, I believe, but it's just not the same. Most part in Horizon 2, it's, it's not the same. Okay, number one and number two is starting to pull away. I don't want that to happen. I'm going to try and catch up. Turn with the car. Turn with the car. 
Can we go around the outside? Can we go in the inside? The inside lane! Yes, we can! We took him in the inside! Oh, this is good. We're climbing up these positions now. Is this a Nissan IDX Nismo up in front? Oh, look! A wacky wave and flip line flame too, man! Yeah! One lap! Nearly done. It's a big house. It's a weird place to put your house and say that. There we go, it's one lap down. It's drift. You are, I'm happy with that, I'm happy with that. Best drift so far, I think. Best drift of the series. Okay, so I think we are actually catching this car in front. Number one just took off like a rocket. He's not coming back. There's the IDX Nismo. Hello! We might be using you next part. Little cool design there to have in your car. Just yellow and black, and we've gone a bit wide. Oh no, it's a battle now, it's a battle. Okay, so we took over the guy who was in the, well, second place, the Nissan. This guy is just storming off. I don't seem to be able to catch him at all. Look at him, he's just off on one. Come back. Come back. Why is he so quick? I don't understand. Right, so coming straight up to the finish line. Still not managed to catch him, the, this guy in front. Anyway, the patch probably didn't actually seem to work. So I don't think that was the patch for the driver tower, but there we go. Wow, he really took off. What car was he? Yeah, we need to know what car he was in. 15,000 credits, okay. What else do we get? We get a level 2. Okay. Let's spin this. Grand prizes have been added. This happens at every driver level, so keep playing to see what's next. Okay, so we're getting a few hot hatches here, so I'm guessing setting you up for the next race. That million credits I look like the look of. I also like the look of the 200 grand. But we will stop. Three, two, one. Oh, okay, okay. At least we get a car. Re 2013 Renault Clio. You know what? You know, I, I would prefer the million, but you know, second best prize, most expensive car there. You know, I'm happy with it. Wow, we got quite a lot for that. Wow. That's one done. Let's go to the next race. Your next race takes place in heavy rain at Sebring International Raceway. Racing on a wet track poses several challenges. Tires lose grip easier during cornering. Braking distances are longer and deep puddles accumulate, causing a risk of hydroplaning. Hmm. The rain in a car that doesn't have a roof. This is going to be fun. Okay, what mods have we got here? We will need mods. We definitely need grip. Definitely. Let's get some money up in here as well. We need grip. We need grip. We need all the grip we can get. Okay, so it looks like we've got... What, what was that? 13% grip? It just goes so silent when you do this. On. And we're off. Okay. Cheeky monkey boy. One name. One name. Oh. Nope. Come on. Oh. Whoa. 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 I didn't expect them to be so much rain at that point there. Wow. First corner. This ain't gonna go well. I've got grip, so hope that that, that will be a lot better. Slow down. Oh, oh! Oh, Toyota had a little bit of a panic there. Wow, this is just incredible. I have 24 cars against me. Or 23. And after them spinning out, oh, it's just mental. Looks like someone's not having a good day there. Bye bye. He actually ran into the side of me. You can't, probably can't see. Yeah, you can see a little bit of a cut, like scratch there. I was gonna say cut. Cars don't cut. Cars don't bleed. Yeah, he bumped into me and I pushed him off, and yeah, he's probably last now. Oh, break! If you go anywhere near the like the throttle on them, then you are pretty much break. Come on, catch up to him. Get that draft. Right, I'm gonna go around the in. No, yeah, inside. There we go. I managed to. Make him scared of me somehow. Toyota with a reef got scared of a Mazda without a roof. 
logic. Okay, we actually took that corner pretty damn good. Catching up to this eagle. Can we pass you is the big question. He's pulling away from me. How? I've got more power than you. Really? You're quicker than me? How are you all quicker than me? Right, I'm still coming on the inside. Oh, there's this Nissan again. Come on, catch up to him. Been that time by eight seconds as well. Me and him both did the same thing. And he did, and he did. Wow, we all do the same thing in these games. Come on, final lap it is. Oh, oh, he broke. You should not have broke there. Are you serious? Come on, stay on the track. You ain't passing me, Mr. Nismo. You ain't. I'm in the Mazda new MX-5. It looks so cool. It looks evil. I'm in the evil car. Number one and number two just stormed away. Let's check what cars. An Alfa Romeo Spider and a Honda Civic. Why are they so quick? Right, I think we got third place just about. There we go. That is a really long track, that. I think that took me like seven minutes or so. <sighs> of course we get the 1,800 credits extra. Are we getting close? Eh, not really. Mazda, how close are we to you? We have got that 2,500 credits added to our jackpot. Showcase events give you a chance to drive some of the world's fastest cars in events that highlight what makes each car special. Okay. You have unlocked your first showcase event. There are many kinds of showcase events, from autocross to passing challenges, organized into separate groups. You have earned access to this showcase group. Select it to learn more about these exciting events. Are you serious? I can only click on this one. I want to see the other ones. Why do you do this? The motorsport pyramid is rocky and steep and very few drivers make it to the very top. Only they know what it's like to race at Le Mans, or Indianapolis, or Bathurst, in cars tailor-made for the occasion. In these showcases, you can get one step closer to experiencing these races, and glimpse into the life of a professional racing driver. Here you'll drive the world's greatest race cars on some of the most famous circuits in international racing. These events are all part of the Race Driver Experience Group. Select this event and we'll enter you in your first showcase race. Oh, I can still only choose this one. Why? Oh, you know what? I'll just go with it. Okay. IndyCar. Your next race will be at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, the highest capacity sports venue in the world with 400,000 seats. IndyCar, America's ultimate single-seater championship, in which cars must somehow remain grounded while doing 230 miles per hour on a banked oval. So aerodynamics is king, which is why these look unlike any other single-seaters in the world. In fact, every team must use a standard Dallara chassis, but can choose between a Chevrolet or Honda engine. Okay, what mods have we got with this? We got grip. I think that should be enough since these cars are quite fast as it is. Okay. Okay, so my teammates are both here. I think last time I was doing this, one of my team teammates ended up overlapping. It's like, of all, really, 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 I'm your teammate and you crash right into me. So, so, some races, they, they just don't know what to do. They are quick though. Wow, they are fast. Are they actually doing 230 down a corner? I'm pulling slightly, but I'm not catching these. Oh my god, how quick are they? They are so fast, why can't I catch them? I'm literally flooring it. 
Okay, two went wide. Come on. Okay, okay, I'm catching now. So they do break on some corners. Okay, I like that. Okay, that's one team. Is he my team? I think he's my teammate. I'm going to say he's my team. I know all the Chevrolet are technically my teammate, but still. We need to use this view. If we're in Indy cars or F1 cars, we need to use this view. It's just like the rule. Oh, you cut right in front of me. Come on. Okay, that's one more pass. Oh! Oh! He bumped in the back of my wheel. That's mean. You don't do that. Okay. We decided to pass a few more characters or a few more cars. I don't know why I call them characters. But yeah, basically they all broke at the last corner and I kind of did it. Right now, I'm not going to break. And that's one more. That's sixth place up in two. Hopefully we'll be able to catch first and second. I don't want to, like, come last. Well, I come third even. Come on. It's a quick car. So quick. We're not exactly doing 235 mile an hour on the corner. But still. We're doing about 230. Come on. It's, it's close enough. It's on the banked oval. So the banked bit is the corner. Okay, we can catch up to these two. These two had a little bit of fight. And do I go in the middle? Yes, I do. Come on. Get that draft. As if the draft's actually working, I'm actually catching him pretty fast. Wow. What is that draft? Oh. Yo, you can't be doing that. You can't cut into me. Okay, final lap. Why are we out in this view? Going back into this. We got dirt on the wind mirror. Wow. I do like that. Not on the wind mirror, on the windscreen. Even though it's barely even a windscreen. What if it rained? Raining in these. Oh, that would be terrible. The amount of power that these produce and the rain where you have to slow down, that's not going to go good. I hope we'll have to do one of them. Sadly, no first place. We did get a second. It's good enough to get all that view, do the celebration. Whoa. There we go. 39 seconds. It's pretty, it's pretty okay. So what happens now? 37 grand. That is a lot of money. Although I do get VIP bonus. And assist and difficulty. Yeah. And we get a level up. Let's do the spin. Ooh! Oh, the Nissan. I saw the Nissan there. So, Nissan IDX Nismo. Obviously, the F1 Lotus E23. What else do we want? I can't really tell. It's moving too quick. But anyway, we're going to stop in three, two, one. The, the one thing I, I didn't really want. I wanted the Lotus or the Nissan. And you give me an Alfa Romeo. Thanks, Forza. Thanks. Nearly got a level up from that, though. Your first showcase race. You'll be invited to many more as you continue your career. Now, let's get back to the Challenger Series. And we will be getting back to the Challenger Series in the next part because that's where i'll see you but yeah i hope you all enjoyed thank you so much for watching don't forget to hit that like button it shows me that you want some more forza motorsport 6 and want it faster but yeah i hope you all enjoyed thanks for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe i'll see you in the next one